mind if I hmm? take a sip of that? Uh, my name's Kong, and this is Drunk Times with Hot Girls. Have you ever had sex on your period? Unfortunately, I have. Yes, I have. A million times. Okay. I'm about to do it tonight. Sometimes we get home when we're really drunk and we're just like, fuck it, dude. No, actually. So why? why? To excuses. To be like, like oh, I just I ate a lot of chicken tonight and the mashed potatoes are really filling me up and so I don't want to. You, you've never had sex on your period either? Oh, I have. Generally speaking, like how does it how does it go? Does it get really messy or occasionally it can be like a mess, but like nobody really cares at that point. I mean honestly, it's the best way to cure those cramps. I love it. I mean from my part it's amazing because you're so well, women are so horny during their periods. In my ex boyfriend's terms, it was like brave part, really right bloody and it's not nice. It's like the Holocaust, yeah. basically. Yeah, he was Jewish. That's so funny. Last year, I also met a guy who is really into period sex. He would lick me, too? Oh, so he went down on you? I know! How would you feel about a guy going down on you while you're on your period? Fuck no. No, I think that's disgusting. No, absolutely not. I can't. Uh, no. 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 <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Once you taste my blood, you're always going to want my blood. And then what next? Like. Um, Marks on my neck. That's why we broke up, I guess. That's one of okay. the reasons. Yeah, yeah. You, you weren't down with him drinking your period blood? If that's like a long-term <laughs> relationship, I can't deal with it. It's like girls swallowing cum, right? It's like, look, if they're going to swallow that, I can swallow your period blood. So it is what it is. How messy does it get? It doesn't really get messy. I have a magical vagina. Okay. Oh, well, that's nice. It's kind of a massacre, Okay. but not quite. You know, you could just throw out bed sheets. Is it like a tablespoon? Is it like a cup? Is it oh, like a gallon? Not a cup. Nothing like um, like horror movie-ish. Okay. No. It wasn't like an Evil Dead type of scene. Oh no. What's the messiest period sex story that you you have? Friend of mine in college, she forgot forgot she had her period. It was my first time to be on my period and have sex, so I was like... What was this, when you were like 12? No. This was your first period? Her entire body was covered in blood, and he like got up to go like, you know, tell his friends that he fucked this chick or something, God only knows, and she saw... And everyone thought that he killed her. Having sex on your period is messy, period. There was blood on our white hotel sheets, but I... I, I I just let the maid take care of it, and that's bad, and that's just really fucked up and wrong, and it was when American's like, horror story was happening. Oh my gosh, it was probably the best sex I've had in a long time, and the disaster afterwards was, it was beautiful. How, how do you feel about that, missing out on that? I think I'm gonna have to try it now. Is, is period sex better? Occasionally. Well, yeah, I mean, like, if you're especially, like, sensitive then it's like it can be nice like better if i'm super into him and i'm wet anyway probably not because it's like too slidey yeah the cleanup is not is not appealing to yeah. me you you like eating the food but you don't want to clean the dishes right, any advice for people who um are either wanting to have period sex or maybe are afraid of period sex try it with your boyfriend first don't try it on a fucking one night stand try it with your boyfriend do it in the shower first feel it out don't be afraid and embrace it because there is no feeling like a uterus that is soothed.